Hello YouTube family and friends. This is the old Chrome Dances and this is part two of uh, working with angels. Um, so what we need to do next is we need to take, I just have some kitchen basil leaves um, and this is what I'm going to uh, be adding for the south quarter um, with the uh, which is the element of fire and it's Archangel Michael so I'm gonna take a little bit of this and I'm just gonna sprinkle it around since it's got a shaker on it so we got that's where we ended at is we needed to get the basil on there so we got the basil on there and that completes that I did uh, go ahead and get another insect going uh, my camera cut me off and I was kind of having a brain fart there at the end of part one knowing there was something I wanted to do and it was to add the basil <laughs> um, I did go ahead and light the candle uh, because I put my thought into everything um, already and I went ahead and lined so you can see now this is today the card I'm working on and then you know each day I'll put up a new card and this will go back through the seven days now I'm gonna go to uh, the north quarter which <clears throat> is Archangel Uriel uh, green is the color and this is earth uh, this is uh, represents um, fertility fertility uh, growth uh, rejuvenation physical healing um, our ambition our personal goals of what we want to accomplish uh, prosperity success how successful we are on getting on track to getting uh, our bodies and minds better uh, luck clarity harmony uh, it's just a long list uh, uh, the earth element is the basis and the foundation of all the elements uh, stability of the body uh, and the heart of life uh, the center of the heart uh, so many of us needs healing there uh, the earth represents uh, like the mother the, she's very nourishing uh, the uh, she's the venom the womb uh, the stone I chose to use is jet for uh, to represent earth I have a very small piece and I'll place that over there and uh, then it would be uh, I decided because I uh, think of earth I think of wheat so I got some wheat berries that I will be taking and just scattering some wheat berries around and all over everywhere else too and uh, yeah so I mean uh, the earth is very 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 special it's our foundation um, now there is one last that uh, I want to do uh, in the elements and it's our it's our spirit uh 
this is the um, element that uh, some consider to be the uh, spirit, the uh, ether, the uh, uh, acacia, whatever it is that one um, goes by. Uh, this is the direction, center, uh, qualities, it's infinity, it's timelessness, spacelessness, and it associates with changes that we want to come and transformation. Uh, the colors are purple. Some of the colors are purple, black, white. Um, animal, uh, snake is a good one for that. And uh, the archangel for this one is Metatron, which is also the angel for children. Uh, and then um, I chose for um, this, I chose, if I can find out where it went to, I thought I had it here. Yep, I do, it just slid down. I chose apple. I have some dehydrated apples. And um, I'm just gonna put a few of these pieces of dehydrated apple around for earth and um, the stone I chose is the clear quartz and I'll put that right there which that's my spirit uh, so we have all the elements going uh, we at this point are basically done. We put our thought into all of what we've done. You know, that we're calling the angels Uriel, Raphael, um, Archangel Michael, um, Gabriel, Metatron, to assist us in accomplishing uh, what we need, you know, what each one of us need. Um, so, uh, and then each day, you know, you go through and, uh, like I would read this card that I have set up because this is the card for today. And this is Monday. It's Monday evening. So I'm going to actually let this start tomorrow. Uh, but I would read this, uh, how do I define taking care of myself? Uh, how do I create a new self-care practice today for healing uh, of whatever my things that I'm asking for? Uh, then I need to observe my comfort level when it comes to doing something that's good for myself. You know, how, what I did and, and how I feel about it. Did it make me feel any better? Did it, do you, I, did it help? Is it going to, you know, something that's going to work for me? And, and as remember, discomfort is a very wise teacher. Um, now once I get through all seven days, okay, doesn't mean that I'm done by far because I can just keep going right on back around and this can be continuous until I feel that my assistance that I've, my plea that I've given to the angels, um, to some of things are straightened up and I'm putting it in their hands to, 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 to work with this because um, and to work with me so I can use my hands to fix myself and my situations and stuff like that. 
Um, now on the candle, um, I will have this will be continually going with the exception when I sleep or when I leave the house. Then I will take this and I will blow it out. I will remove it and I will put a like a green candle, a small green candle um, bow holder, candle holder with like maybe a green light up candle or it doesn't really have to be green, it could be white. And then I'll just write either on the candle or the holder I can use the permanent marker healing for my body, my mind, my spirit, you know, and such on it so that it's still going but it's a safety factor because you don't leave your house with a burning open flame and you don't go to sleep with one so at least I don't so um, there is an alternative to I switch it out then at that point for safety measures um, and this is how it ends up looking and the only um, other thing that I wanted to kind of add was just a simple little piece of flower, greenery, or whatever to represent earth. Um, it's pretty and I can still easily pull my cards in and out and um, yeah, so that's uh, that's that basically, and it's going, and um, hopefully, uh, with uh, assistance and faith, um, some things will start evolving. Uh, this works in its own time. Um, I can't force it, um, so I'm gonna see how this goes. But I just wanted to share with you guys. Uh, work my way of working with angels and then I also invite not only the archangels the other angels too that want to come and assist uh, guardian angels other angels um, you know that are willing and able to assist with some of my needs so um, yeah so at any rate um, that's my angel working, and I just wanted to share that with you. Um, you know, we've all got our way of prayer or worship, um, and some don't, but those who don't may just want to watch anyway, and if not, they can walk away. Uh, but yeah, that's my angel working, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was my first time of doing something like this on YouTube, and I was very nervous, actually. You know, I mean, I know the stuff. I could do it with my eyes closed, but um, it's just, it was different for me from my hauls. Uh, because I'm so used to doing the hauls, and I am definitely going to continue hauls, but I don't always have the cash flow to go buy stuff, and there's other things I'd like to put up um, besides just hauls. So at any rate, um, each day, now I am going to count this for Tuesday, because actually it is Tuesday. It's like 2 in the morning. I'm a night owl. Um... So, um, this is my Tuesday, and, uh, I, uh, then we'll come back each day, and I will read the next card that's going to go up, and go through the book, and I have to read through the book, though, because I, you know, I can't memorize at this age, or that, what it corresponds with the card in the book to let you guys know so for each one until we got all seven days so we got one we got six more to go so there'll be six more videos uh and those will be quick because we've already went through all this we don't have to do but just the card in the book co corresponding 
um, for the ones that I chose for myself. You could even take a uh, one of those little four by six recipe cards or a piece of post-it and write down what you would like, you know, and do it that way. You know, you don't have to have all this stuff. Uh, you can set it up however you like, you know, if you don't have the stones, you don't have, let's say, lavender. There's always substitutes, and you can do whatever you feel is you're comfortable with. So, um, all right, it's later. Later, guys. Oh, actually, I'm going to hold on a minute because I'm going to set it on my altar. If I got time. I got to do. I'm going to set it over on my angel altar and take you guys over there once I get it set. And you have to give me a minute because it's very tight. So I have to get through without taking everything out. So excuse me for passing in front of you. But this way you can kind of see. Hopefully I won't knock everything over drop things. I'll put this over here then I'll bring you guys over. All right, I managed to get it moved. Hi, without dropping it, which is amazing because I drop a lot of things. Uh, this is my angel altar. So this is a lamp. There's what... Uh, I just worked on my working with angels. You can see all the cards. This actually lights up, but I don't have an extra plug for it, and I'm going to be moving in any way. Isn't it beautiful? Search Angel Michael. Some of my Dollar Tree stuff. Virgin Mary. So at any rate, well, there goes the timer, so I'm going to lose ya. Later, guys.